Good evening. We start tonight with GE Transportation, who after a series of cuts and layoffs may finally have something to celebrate. Jackie Roberts tells us about the big announcement made today at GE. She's in the control room. Jackie. Jill and Sean, engineers at GE, tell us 2018 is all about learning to think differently. Today they unveiled the first of 30 locomotives to be made in Erie, built for the Ukraine. Transportation leaders from two countries are joining forces for one common mission, building TE-33A locomotives, a long name with a long path ahead. Earlier this year, GE signed a $1 billion contract with Ukrainian Railways to build 30 of these machines. And now they're seeing the nearly finished product. It's a new opportunity for Erie and a milestone for GE. Oh, I'm an engineer, I'm a geek. I just love uh, seeing the new locomotive and, and all of the, the work that the team's done uh, making this a reality. Engineers say this modern design will replace at least one and a half to two locomotives that are already in service. The locomotive itself is uh, going to be about 70% uh, more emission compliant. It's uh, going to consume 20, 25% less fuel. Prior to the announcement, both companies were able to examine the locomotive through a virtual reality system at GE. The acting CEO of Ukrainian Railways says they searched for the right team to be a long-standing, stable partner. For us, it's an important moment, an important milestone in uh, uh, renovation and revitalization of our company. The Lawrence Park location is responsible for about 90% of the production, and employees say they're up for the challenge. Erie's a great uh, design and development center that's brought good things to North America, and we're bringing those good things to the world. The framework agreement includes additional locomotives for the next 10 years, the modernization of locomotives, and long-term maintenance. But GE also has some other major projects on the horizon. Today they gave us an inside look at one of their biggest recent investments, an additive development lab. Sean? Well, and as you said at the start, Jackie, finally some good news, reason to smile here. Yes, definitely. Officially some good news at GE. All right, thanks, Jackie.